Well, if you love fishing, you love hunting, you love anything outdoors, we have some pretty exciting news coming from our Outdoors Bound team. For those of you who want more of our award-winning outdoors reporting, we're going to be launching an Outdoors Bound podcast today. It's going to be hosted by none other than WFXR's George Noliff. And George, joining me in the studio this morning to talk a little bit more about it. George. Good morning, Brandon. Hey, folks, how are you all doing? Now, we've been doing Outdoors Bound segments since late 2020 with a number of stories airing every week, as well as the big old fish segments on Fridays. The popularity of the franchise has just exploded. Folks, you wanted more, we heard you, so boom, podcast. How y'all doing, folks? George Noel from WFXR's Outdoors Bound here. Thanks for being with us. So this is the very first Outdoors Bound podcast. That's a little behind the scenes look at the making of the first one. Now, it's no secret that y'all love things like fishing and hunting and other outdoors adventures. Our Outdoors Bound podcasts are hopefully going to meet the demand for something extra. They're longer form, give us a little more time to really get into the outdoors things you love. We'll tell some great to stories, talk to the experts and people who make getting outdoors so much fun. Here's another behind the scenes look. How would you like to live at the beach and fish for a living? Man, that's like the dream, right? There's a guy named Trip Sims. He's from Southside. He collects his paycheck by making people happy one fish at a time. He's a mate with the Calabash Fishing Fleet out of Calabash, North Carolina. I enjoy it a whole bunch, you know? I mean, <clears throat> like I said, just being able to go out there with people from all over the country and everything and getting to meet them and talk to them, you know, not only do you get to go fishing and have fun doing that, but you get to learn a little bit about life and each other as well. You know, today we had cobia, we had red drum, had ringtail porgies, chocolate chip porgies, of course, black sea bass. It's, there's all sorts of possibilities, sometimes maybe even some sharks. It all just kind of depends. Trip, I thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you, Mr. George. That's pretty cool. That was pretty cool. I actually felt like I was back in my old radio days. In addition to talking to people like Trip and other experts, we're going to talk techniques, destinations, gear, and wildlife. Now, how can you listen to the Outdoors Bound podcast? It'll be available right now every, more, every Tuesday morning, 7 o'clock in the morning. Just go to our website, WFXRTV.com. Then go to the Outdoors Bound podcast page. It's under community. That's where you're going to find it. And George, how can viewers and listeners kind of be a part of this journey with you? Well, we want them to contact us with story ideas and to let us know what they want to hear about. When we launched Outdoors Bound almost four years ago, Brandon, we knew based on just hunting and fishing interest in this area, it's going to be popular. But it's outperformed even what we thought it would. Not only folks in this area, the segments get picked up in Richmond, Norfolk, D.C., Bristol, so folks around the Commonwealth are looking at it. And we have people who follow us online from across the country and even across international borders. I've had uh, followers from Canada, Europe, Asia, I mean, all over. Now, this gives folks the chance to take Outdoors Bound with them wherever they go, in the car, camping, on a train, in the kitchen, wherever, and whenever. It'll come out every Tuesday morning at 7. All right, George Noliff, I know you're excited. I'm sure all of your fans are very excited as well. Thanks for joining us this morning.